it's me now welcome back to my channel or if this is the very first video that you're seeing of me then welcome to my channel please be sure to hit that subscribe button down below if you didn't already i post every day of the week for all and today in this video i have a story time i'm not a story time why did i say story time i meant to say a, a video of my top 10 most memorable birthdays i thought this would be kind of a fun video to do because I have so many birthdays that I remember from my life and my childhood. I thought it would be fun to talk about some of my most memorable birthdays I had. And I um, wanted to make this video because I love sharing my special memories with you guys that I have. So I'm gonna get started and I hope you guys enjoy the video. So number one on my list would have to be my 11th birthday. So this is one birthday I always remember because it was the time I had two friends who accidentally got confused and thought they were playing hide and seek at my birthday party for some weird reason and hid on everybody, like hid in my closet on everybody. Buddy, and then we actually, my parents actually had to send them home because they did not like the fact that they were playing hide and seek on us and it was just not a very fun thing but despite the, that my whole birthday party was really good all my friends and I painted pumpkins we had my family over um, we all hung out in the hot tub and we just had a great time overall time except for that little incident so I do have two full stories about hide and seek gone wrong at my birthday party t party and like I said I have two stories of that and if you want to see them I will link them both in the description box down below well if you'd like to check those both out Number two on my list would be my second birthday. So this one I actually just remember from a home video. And when I had my second birthday, my mom had made everybody these cute, adorable little capes. I'll actually get my cape really quick just to show you guys. Because I wasn't able to find the cape while I was filming the video, I ended up inserting pictures of the cape so you guys could see what it looked like. So let me know what you think of my picture taking skills. So unfortunately, I don't really know where I put the cape. Um, it's somewhere in my closet, and once I kind of get my closet organized, I'll find it. So it's a cute little little um, cape that has flowers on it, and um, it was like a green cape, and it had like pink flowers on it. So that was my um, um little thing and my mom had that was my birth my second birthday and that's I remember that just from a home video I remember we went to a park and we had all my cousins come and everybody and family friends and it was such a fun birthday <laughs> number three on my list would have to be my 12th birthday so my 12th birthday we went to the skating rink like it wasn't like an ice skating rink it was a roller skating rink and we all had a good time and we skated around and I ended up not wanting to skate for the rest of my birthday party party and I fell on my butt and it hurt pretty bad and um but I still had a really good time despite the fact I couldn't skate <laughs> happy my 13th birthday so this is um a birthday I remember it's kind of sad I ended up getting stuck in the hospital on the day I was supposed to have my birthday party which was act my actual birthday because I was in the hospital pretty much every weekend and I was stuck in the hospital for 13 days be due to a medicine that they were giving me and they um were kind of worried about it destroying um, one of my organs in my body so I had to be stuck in the hospital until they figured out if the medication was safe for me in my body and it was just a medication patient that they were giving me while I was going through chemotherapy and it was very sad very it was kind of a difficult birthday for me because I was just so excited to celebrate my birthday with my friends and family but what was nice was we had a small party for me at the hospital and we were able to go into the bigger room with my family and a lot of some of my cousins came and Two of my friends came to the hospital and it was really nice because I was pretty sad that I couldn't celebrate my actual birthday party on my birthday, day, which is the day it was supposed to be, but I still had a really good time despite the fact I was stuck in the hospital. And then we ended up celebrating my birthday later on again and um, 
I had a friend that came to my birthday party, but we accidentally, we actually had to send her home because she had allergies. I mean, even though it was just allergies, my parents weren't comfortable with it. And um, I felt kind of bad she got sent home because she was really excited to see me. And I have a full story about that. And if you want to see it, I will link it in the description box down below. So that was a great, I still had a really good birthday despite the fact I was still going through chemo. And it was just one of those birthdays I pretty much remember. <laughs> Number five on my list would be my 21st birthday. So this is another birthday I remember. Um, this was when, right when I was beginning to be, um, that this was in my 20s. And this was a pretty fun birthday. We went to um, a Thai restaurant for karaoke, even though I'm not a big fan of Thai food. And um, we had just a great time. I celebrated my birthday with my friends and family, and it was just a fun little um it was just a fun birthday and the restaurant we went to had karaoke which i love karaoke if you don't know me <laughs> number um six on my list would have to be my 15th birthday so i remember my 15th birthday because it was so much fun and um i had a sleepover but the week i was planning my sleepover none of my friends could come so luckily we were able to move it to make it easier for them and they um the day i planned the weekend i planned it it was easier for my friends to come sadly i only had like two friends show up for the party but i still had a great time because my sister invited one of her friends and i still had a really good time with both my two friends who came to my birthday party <laughs> Number seven on my list would have to be my 19th birthday party. So this was when I was a senior in high school. This one was kind of sad for me because um, I accidentally planned my birthday party on um, the night we had homecoming and um, barely any of my friends could come to my birthday party except for one of my friends because I accidentally planned my birthday party on the night of our homecoming week at our school and all my friends were wanting to go to the dance because it was the last year of high school for everybody and I was a little bit bummed but then, but then I was still happy because I was still able to have one friend over for my birthday party and um I still had a really good time and my mom invited the family over so um it still ended up being pretty good and I have a full story about that one and if you want to see that I will link it down below if you didn't see. <laughs> Number eight on my list would have to be my 16th um, um, birthday party. So this was um, another birthday party I remember because um, I had all of my friends come to my birthday party and I had a great time. I was hanging out with everybody. I had so much fun and we were like all talking, talking. We watched one of my favorite movies, which is Robin Hood Men in Tights. And it was just a really fun birthday party. And I had a lot of great, I had a really good time with all of my friends who came to my party. <laughs> Number nine on my list would have to be my 31st birthday. So this is a birthday I had um, two years ago. And it was a really fun birthday party. I'm 33 today, just so you guys know. I had a really fun birthday party, but I did have a little up and down and I do have two full stories about that. And if you want to see them, I will link them down in the description box below. And um, despite that, I still had a really good time. I got to hang out with my friends, my family, and I had a really nice dinner with everybody at the party. <laughs> Number 10 on my list would have to be my 32nd birthday. This was such a fun birthday. I had so much fun. Um, last year, and this was last year. And um, for this birthday, I went out to dinner with my, for that birthday, I went out to dinner with my family. 
and my friend and I had a good time and we were going to do karaoke one night but the karaoke place that we were going to was already closed and so we ended up finding another place to do karaoke and um, when the place actually when we went to do karaoke the power went out I do have a full story about that which I'll also link in the description box down below it was such a fun birthday I went out to dinner with my family and friends and then we went out to do karaoke um not that same night but because the karaoke place we were planning on going to was already closed but we went to a different restaurant like i think a few nights later and then we had a little incident when the power went out but it was still pretty funny despite the fact the power went out which i hate power outages but it was just unexpected and funny honey okay so those are my top 10 most memorable birthdays i hope you guys enjoyed the video thank you so much for watching please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already i post every day of the week for a while and i'll see you in another video soon bye if you enjoyed this video then please subscribe and give it a thumbs up that would really make me nice Number five on my list would have to be, um, oh no, that's, oops, my bad. <coughs> Number eight on my list would have to be my 16th birthday party. Oh, whoops, sorry, I skipped one.